this video lecture I am going to evaluate limit x tend to 0 sin x divided by sin px. So let's see the answer. So first here writing the given limit x tend to 0. Now here writing sin ax divided by sin bx. So we know the formula of sin sorry first here we need to write limit limit x tend to 0 sin x divided by x that is equal to 1. So here writing limit x tend to 0. So this here sin ax we need in denominator ax. Okay so this same obviously we need to multiply here ax. So this can say there is no any effect. Now thereafter we can write So thereafter we can write 1 and here sin bx. So we required here bx. We need to divide. So we need to multiply bx here. So this this cancel. There is no any effect. Now after that limit x tend to 0. So this here writing sin ax divide by ax. And this here we can write ax divide by this bx writing here after that 1 by sin bx divide by bx now after that here this is sin x by x that is equal to 1 now if I include here sin ax or uh, divide by ax this term same so that this value that return 1, this value that return 1. And here a x is cancelled. So suppose if you assume a x equal to y sin y by y and y tend to 0 then this return 1. So this return 1 here after that a divided by b and 1 this return 1. And after doing the calculation here you can get a by B. So this is the answer. One time going to repeat. Write the given. This is the theorem you should use. And here we need to make that sin AX by AX form. So AX divided AX multiplied. Here with sin BX, BX divided BX multiplied. There is no any effect. This cancel. After that combine this and here you can get this terms so this that returned 1 and here xx cancel finally you get a by b so this is the way we can evaluate this limit questions so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you